I said, the only way I'm gonna beat these niggas, I got to get in the game. And when I get in the game, they can't beat me. I swear to God, ain't them niggas got more. I got more game, motherfucking baby fingers. Them niggas got their whole body. So they know that. They know I'm coming. They see me. You know what I'm saying? They see the hip hop fraternity. They see me signing artists. They see me about to make my move because them niggas too stingy. They don't want to give up the game. They don't want to let nigga in. You know what I'm saying? They make a nigga starve. That's why I say you see the same motherfucking usual suspects in this game. And this ain't no clickbait. This ain't trying to get no motherfucking views or nothing. This is facts. No, real talk. Why in the fuck? I mean, no, I'm, it's I'm, real. I'm no, saying, but, why in the fuck do you got the same niggas, right. you know, doing the same shit when it's so many kids and, and being a, a rapper is like trying to be a raindrop in a motherfucking tsunami. They won't because even help. Because you're saying me, the, it's, more, it's less niggas than being rappers than it's been in the NBA. You got a better chance of being in the NBA than you got to be a rapper because it's the same usual suspect. Yeah, we on Boss Talk 101. Yeah, we gonna talk. You just said when we start talking about the old, I thought about academics, and academics been going in uh, on LL Russell Simmons. He been really because of what you, with me and you, kind of discussing it. He don't. He feel like he don't owe them anything because he says, "Hey, man, you know, we, uh, you know, I didn't get nothing from y'all. I, I didn't get no direction. I came through an independent route. I can speak now personally. he says, twenty million dollars later, I don't have to answer to y'all." And I can say what I want to say on my platform. But how do you feel about that? I feel the exact same way because a lot of these artists, right, they're the same usual suspects. So you got these people at the top tier. And they've been the same people at the top tier for years. So when an artist come out, a new artist like Drake or something, they jump on this album. Or Lil Baby, they jump on this album to stay relevant, right? But they don't give nothing back to the culture. You know what I'm saying? They, they, it's like a popsicle. They sucking on the same popsicle until ain't no sickle left. It's just a stick. And yeah. this is what a lot of these people who's established, and you know, and they talk about all these white people and this Universal and all these other companies. But some of them do to artists worse than what even these people have done to them. You know what I mean? Wow. And the worst thing you could do is not pass the baton. You know, and I think a lot of them they hold on to it and you know, some of them almost some of them are grandparents, grandparents and they just want to hold on to it when they could have been passed out. You got people that's in the game that's big, they got nephews and they got sons and daughters that's ready to go. They but they know. refuse to get up, give up that popsicle. They want to keep on sucking on that popsicle until ain't nothing left. Until hip hop, you know, probably do like everything else until it wither into the, into the, into the abyss. You know what I'm saying? Until it's no but longer. But again, a, what around. you say it makes sense. You the the other generation have somehow figures it out. No matter if they hand it to them or the not. Chillings. But see, me personally, this is my personal experience. I'm figuring. I'm pimping Ken, right? I'm, I'm, I'm trending all over the world. You know, at this time, I was doing 10 million views, you know, way before, you know. Views was views. Views was views. <laughs> I'm doing 10 million views. You know, I think I did about 10 million views on one of Vlad's uh, video. Yeah. So I'm doing a, a world star. I'm killing it. I'm on, I got five videos where I'm featured in on, on, uh, on BET uh, Countdown. And now one of them niggas said, hey, man, come on, let's do a movie. Hey, now one of them niggas said, hey, man, come on, let's do this. Wow. You know what they did? I'm pimp this. I'm pimp that. They tried to take they tried to what take, I what created, created and say that it was them. So, you know, you see this, you know, from my perspective, you know what I'm saying? So I, I can imagine how these young people feel because I felt the same way. Wow. You know what I'm saying? So that's why I, it, I said, the only way I'm going to beat these niggas, I got to get in the game. And when I get in the game, they can't beat me. I swear to God, ain't them niggas got more game. I got more game than motherfucking baby fingers. Them niggas got their whole body. So they know that. They know I'm coming. They see me. You know what I'm saying? They see the hip hop fraternity. They see me signing artists. They see me about to make my move because them niggas too stingy. They don't want to give up the game. They don't want to let nigga in. You know what I'm saying? They make a nigga starve. That's why I say you see the same motherfucking usual suspects in this game. And this ain't no clickbait. This ain't trying to get no motherfucking views or nothing. This is facts. No, real talk. Why I, in the fuck? I mean, no, no, it's no, real. No, I'm no, saying, but, why in the fuck do you got the same right. niggas, you know, doing the same shit when it's so many kids and, and being a, a rapper is like trying to be a raindrop in a motherfucking tsunami. They won't because even help. Because you're saying me, the, it's, more, it's less niggas than being rappers than it's been in the NBA. You got a better chance of being in the NBA than you got to be a rapper because it's the same Usual suspects. When, when Russell Simmons spoke on it, Russell Simmons said, we, we done helped, we helped everybody. We helped Leo Cohen is one of the guys. Now, this is a guy that's running YouTube. I'm like, in my mind, did that really help us or did that hurt us? Well, 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 you know, a lot of times. I mean, time, I don't know if it helped uh, a lot, a lot of them a niggas, a lot, a, lot, a lot of them niggas ain't really helped shit because, you know, you know, if you look at it, you know what I'm saying? I mean, niggas is just getting, 
the, the you know the little babies, the the NBA young boys, those the cold niggas. Yeah, these the niggas that's getting all the money. They getting a the half a million. Drake's they getting the they, them niggas used to get ten and twenty. You could book the mix for thirty thousand to fill to, to fill up a a, 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 a a what they call it shit Coliseum arena. Call it arena. Yeah. arena. So you know what I'm saying me the young niggas is figuring it out. The young niggas got the game. You know the young rappers. I will fuck with the young rappers. I will fuck with you know baby. I will fuck with you know forty two dub. I will fuck with you know a black youngster and, 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 and uh, a finesse two times. These the niggas that got the game. You know what I'm saying? I mean, they understood how to monetize this shit. They understand how to go set up a YouTube. They understand how to, you know, get money from these uh, 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 Google Sense talk. ads. You know what I'm saying? I mean, yeah. So, so that's 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 what we have. So, but but a lot of the, the older guys, they got their money. You know what I'm saying? But they got it from the old guard. They got it from the old school. Now these young boys, they get money like hand over fist. But so, was they when they was getting the money? Wasn't they? I mean, they was getting it off three sixty deals. They wasn't even a lot of them boys. They left broke. Man, listen. Did you hear what I just said? Man, listen. I get. Yeah, we on boss talk one on one. Yeah, we gonna talk.